Rachel. So you know what? She took me out and she styles Missy Misdemeanor Elliot. So she took me out and got me these earrings to wear when I go to the inner cities and do speeches at schools so that the kids can relate to me more. I'm trying to be more relatable. People think the proportions are all off. That I think they look great. That doesn't even make sense. It's I think I look gorgeous. Yeah, I look gorgeous. And here's the thing. No, you can only have earrings like that if you've got short, spiky hair like me. You just can't, you can't carry that. Well, I'm sorry yet that I've got long, luscious, flowing, feminine locks, but I think I look gorgeous. And you know, when I walk into those inner city high schools and I get up on stage with these earrings Are and you, I, I get sure to the mic, I get, Kevlar vest, I'm right? going to have a Kevlar vest. I'm going to get somehow incorporate bulletproofness into my Chignon. Hey kids. I'm Alaska Governor Sarah Palin, and I'm gonna be your vice president. What you know about me? What you what you know about me? What you know about me? What you what you know? I said my lip gloss is cool. My lip gloss is popping. I'm gonna be an awesome vice president. Please don't vote. It's so great to be here today in Detroit. Don't yeah. vote. It's so great to be here on the south side of Chicago. Don't vote. It's so great to be here in Newark. Don't vote, don't vote, don't vote. I am in fun at Cabrini Green. Don't vote. Woo! Hey, Marcy Projects, what's up? Don't vote, don't vote, don't vote. That's that's what I'm going to be doing on my next Whistle Stop tour. You know, I have a lot in common with the residents of the inner city, okay? We all like guns. Yeah. We all like to have just an unchecked number of offspring. Just spitting babies out like some kind of machine. I got that. Uh, we both believe that only God can judge me. Thank you. Yeah, Tupac I and I that. are like this on that. And we also enjoy teenage pregnancies. Teenage pregnancies. Love it. And complex and confusing hairstyles. So pretty much I am a ghetto mama. And I just need to communicate well, you know, that. Everyone says that Bill Clinton was the first black president. Well, you're going to be the first black vice president. And then president once Mr. McCain. Yeah. Yeah. But, you know, Goes to his final need, reward. We don't need to have a real black president. No. Ew. That would, you know, ew. We can just have white people do it for them. Yeah. Thank which you. Which is better for everyone. Oh, my God. I mean, if you were just a little black boy just living there in the inner city, wouldn't it make you so happy to look on TV and see a white person and say, all right, I'm in good hands. I'm in good hands. Especially if it was a pretty white lady like me. Yeah. Pounces! Pounces, which is gonna be the prettiest kitty in the Oval Office? Me! Pounces, who am I gonna make secretary of Brit Oh. I resent that. I think it's time to get a new cat. Where's my gun?